things you didn't know about. The stories behind these five Singapore MRT stations. Dakota. The old Kalang Airport was located in this area from 1937 to 1955, and planes would land here frequently. One of the most common aircrafts that landed there was the Douglas DC-3. It's more commonly known as the Dakota, and that's where the name comes from. You've probably also seen the name used for the iconic Dakota Crescent housing estate, which will be redeveloped for public housing. Tan Ka Ki. Okay, so this station is the first and only one named after a person's full name. Why? Tan Ka Ki is the founder of Hua Chong Institution, and the station is located underneath the campus. So at first, the working name of the station was Duchess, named after the road near it. In 2008, LTA opened its feedback portal to seek suggestions for the names of nine stations in the downtown line. The students and alumni of Hua Chong Institution wanted it to be named Hua Chong, since it was literally just there. A year later, the station ended up being formally renamed Tan Ka Ki by the Ministry of Transport to honour him for his contribution to education and the local community. This sparked a debate on whether MRT names should be named to reflect the locations clearly. LTA said that the name Tan Ka Ki was a top choice in a public poll for the station's name and that there was also a road nearby named after Tan. The more you know. One North The only station without a capital letter and it has a hyphen. There's no official explanation why it's styled this way though. Perhaps to look cool and futuristic? Apparently, the name takes reference to the fact that Singapore's latitude is slightly over one degree north of the equator. The other options for names were Portsdown and Ayer Raja. Next station, City Hall. Does Singapore have an actual city hall? Nope, but we used to. The station was named after the old city hall, which was converted to the National Gallery in 2015. It was actually supposed to be named St Andrew's MRT, but was changed to reflect the location of the station. Fun MRT fact, City Hall MRT station is one of the earliest stations to be opened, on 12 December 1987. It is also designated as a civil defence shelter that will be activated in a national emergency. Guess there's more to this station than the late night crowd at Starbucks and McDonald's. City Hall is also the station that has probably caused you some confusion. Raffles City Shopping Centre is here, but not at Raffles Place. Nani? Farrer Park Station. Farrer Road. Another station name that may have caused you some confusion. So sorry to those who thought that Farrer Park and Farrer Road were the same thing. Newsflash, they aren't. Farrer Park is at Little India and Farrer Road is Bukit Timah, about 6 kilometers apart. Although, they are named after the same person. Roland John Ferrer. From 1913 to 1931, he was the president of the former Municipal Commissioners in Singapore, an authority which managed local urban affairs appointed by the British colonial government. Ferrer Park, Mustafa, Ferrer Road, Empress Market. Doors are closing. So now you know the stories behind these five MRT station names. Till next time on Things You Didn't Know About. Ding, 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 ding.